I love the black church. I owe everything to the black church. The church has traditionally been the beacon that guided us through the valley of our despair to the promised land. The church used to be our only voice in this world. It provided a refuge from the daily injustices of Jim Crow. It gave us great institutions of higher learning that taught us very much but very little. It also gave birth to a movement towards freedom and equality for its members and blessed us with great leaders who organized and pushed and marched us toward the prize. This is the black church that I love so dearly. But as of late, it appears that the black church has lost some focus, decided to wage a holy war on marriage equality. This issue at its heart is a civil rights issue as it affects Christians and Jews and Muslims and believers and non-believers all in the same way. There's just no way you can deny anyone the privilege of a civil marriage in this country if you are following these directions. But we must have holy war, right? Well, let's send out the troops to buy sandwiches and a show of solidarity. Show everyone that we stand with God. But you're also standing with groups that hate you and then are godly. Groups that fund a systematic nationwide attack on our voting rights. Like in Tennessee and Pennsylvania where they've passed these new voter ID laws and are making it impossible for our people to cast their votes. But that doesn't matter to you because you're on God's side and this is holy war. So let's start talking about not backing the president anymore because he's on the wrong side of this holy war. Never mind that we supported him on other biblical no-nos in the past. And while we're at it, let's throw the NAACP under the bus too. This is holy war. We don't take prisoners. Look, you've heard what Mitt Romney has planned. He told you. And now he's doubled down by drafting Ryan to the team. Can you really afford to question our best line of defense over this one issue? No, that is not the way. You taught me that for everything there is a season and a time for every purpose under heaven. Now is election season. We are under attack and we got one guy in this fight. Now is the season for us to be fighting going backwards, not to be taking pot shots at our only horse in this race. Black Church, your people need you to keep your eye on the ball. We are at war, but you've been fighting on the wrong front. Get it together and let's save the casting of stones for those without sin.